opportunity. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Calgary's been blocking shots over the last few games at a crazy rate. Their players lie down to block shots. They get into the shooting lanes to block them standing up. This is something they work on pretty consistently at practice. Picks it up in his own end. Can he generate something? Sticked away. Well, that was hard to follow. Fires! Marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. Oh, good job to block that and keep play moving. Great glove save, but it's loose. Nice play by the goaltender to freeze it up and get a whistle. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. Moves to the corner. Slid back across from one point to the other. What a terrific opportunity. Right in front. Tip to the net. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. You got to find a way to put it in the net. They won that faceoff. Can they clear it? Portland's in their own end setting things up. These guys started back in the fall. Their dream was to be at this very moment, and the dream is realized. It is a most noble part of a collision sport, an exhausting series of games. Handshakes replace all the adrenaline from the last hours. The man chosen playoff MVP gets the Conn Smythe Trophy. Boy, is this ever well deserved. It's often said it's the hardest prize to win because it takes eight weeks. And by tradition, the captain is the first to hold it high. And there's always a pecking order as to how it gets handed off, and that's all a part of Stanley Cup lore. You can only imagine how much soreness you fight through in a collision sport. Guys have lifted this cup with dislocated shoulders after hernia surgeries just two days before. Doesn't matter. It's over 30 pounds. They find a way. You play that hard and that long. You get your names on a trophy, rings on your fingers, and one last photograph, evidence of it all.